Are you ready? Let's go. Let's go. So let's go take a look. Hi. I want to show you today about the importance of feeding birds in the winter time. What I feed them and why it's important. The main food we give them is sunflower seeds. I don't use a mix. I use pure black sunflower seeds. It'll it's the seed that'll attract the most birds for a single type of seed. So you can try other things and you'll feed a lot of black birds but black sunflower seed is really the best to use. The birds have been busy, it's been cold. We've had a couple of weeks of below average temperatures ranging between minus 15 and minus 25. And so they've really emptied the feeders and sunflower seed is a high oil seed. So they, it gives them lots of calories, lots of energy. So that's the one ingredient, I'll show you the next one. So here's the second ingredient, suet. It's just beef fat. Uh, it usually comes from around the, the back and it's also very high energy and the birds have really been going through it like crazy. So it's a, it's a, it's a normal food they're used to. If ever a, a moose or a deer gets killed, the birds won't care for the meat. They'll go for the fat. And it's a very vital source of energy for the winter to keep them through, especially through the coldest nights. It's important to move your feeders around anywhere between around 100 feet, so 30 meters between one week and the other. And, uh, and that's really to allow the birds to scour every single tree and every branch where the birds uh, may find some food. And the food they normally would find is the wintering versions of all the insects that are pests. So especially things like codling moth will winter in the trees and it's important to, for them to pick up as many of these wintering versions as possible. So that looking through the trees is a very important function that the birds do in the winter. But I guess I have to admit, I also like seeing the birds. I especially like to be able to feed them right out of my hand in the winter. Well, Bo's even marking her territory. But take a look at, at all these, some of our old beehives, we haven't put them away. But look at all the droppings. That's just since a week ago. And so the birds like to be able to hide and sleep in a sheltered spot. If you give them the choice, they will use, oh, somebody got eaten here. So it's not just a shelter for the birds, but also for the predators to come and pick them up. And so we put, uh, we've had one feeder up here since the fall, we're middle of January. And we have one su suet feeder and one sunflower feeder. Oh, this one too, just about got finished. So timing it to, to come visit once a week to fill up feeders is, is about right. So I set up the second, feeder here in this honey locust and one of the things I've done is I've just taken a shovel and packed the snow down below it uh, just because otherwise there's a lot of seed falls in the fresh snow and just isn't really accessible to the birds so this way they'll be able to access it as they scratch and the seed falls uh, they'll be eating it right off the snow this way Should you feed birds? I would say ideally not, but I don't do it for the ecological reason as much as for the benefit that they give. The ideal would be that your permaculture orchard would have plenty of habitat, plenty of food sources throughout the winter, uh, but that just isn't the case right now. If you see 
all around, the snow is pretty deep. Most of the plants that the birds would have access to are not really accessible, the seeds at least. So one other food source that we have in the orchard for fruit eating birds, we keep some of our apple trees with fruit in them. So we keep about 10 or 15 trees depending on how many apples they have. And that's a, a really good food source for the wax wings and any robins, especially the ones coming back early in the spring. So we saw what to feed them, sunflower seeds and suet, where every 100 feet or 30 meters throughout the orchard and move it every week. When to feed them, I usually feed them about once a week. Why feed them? Because it's nice to see birds and it's also a good way to help control some of the wintering insects. And how to feed them? Well, feed them with, with a sled and a scoop and fill up those feeders. So go enjoy the winter. And if you like this, please subscribe and tell your friends about it. I'll try to put more videos average once a week throughout the, throughout the next year. Thanks.